Welcome to the creating a random section on an assessment demo. In this demo, you will learn how to create a random section folder and add assessment questions to it from the question library. At the end of this demo, you will be able to create an assessment with a random set of test questions. First, log into your D2L account and go into your course. If you want students to receive a random set of questions, you can create a random section in the assessment. This will prevent different students from taking the same questions or questions in the same order. You also have the option of making certain questions mandatory so every student has to take those particular questions and then the remaining questions can be randomized. Instead of building questions inside a random folder, Questions can only be imported into the random folders, so make sure you have created the questions in the question library first. On the gray course navigation bar, click the assessments link. Click the new quiz button to create a new quiz or click on an existing quiz to edit it. Click the add edit questions button select new then random section enter a name for the random section in the name field and then select save click on the folder for the random section you just created to go into it note that the random section has a purple folder icon beside it select import and then under the selection source drop down box choose the folder from the question library where the questions are located that you wish to import the folder and questions within it will appear below choose the questions or the entire folder if you would like all of them remember if you choose them all they will all be possible questions click save. Now you can see a list of all of the questions. At the top select how many per attempt which will determine how many random questions will appear out of the list below. If you enter 5 for example and have 20 possible questions then each student will receive 5 randomized questions out of the 20. They will not necessarily be the same 5. You also have the option of changing the points for the questions. All of the questions in the random folder will be worth the same amount. Click Save at the top. Before you select Done Editing Questions, to return to the Properties tab. Make any other changes to the assessment settings, and then click the Save and Close button. You have now successfully created an assessment with a set of random questions.